What's up guys, it's the tech guy here and today I'm going to be talking about a little app called Showbox. Let's get on with the video. Now, to get Showbox, what you want to do is go on the internet. Once you're on the internet, type in Showbox. I'm just going to copy, I'm just going to paste it right there. I may enter or search. I'm going to put the link in the in the description um for the for the website. The website looks just like this. What you want to do to download um, Showbox APK on your phone, uh, you want to scroll down so you see th these words in um, highlighted in blue, Showbox APK download. It's right under step two, open the browser and click on the following link in the download. Um, and following the link to download the Showbox APK file. You want to click on the blue words that says showbox apk download right here so you click on it you'll be taken to this website scroll down and um you want to download version six i mean version 4.61 um with the parentheses and 81 in the parentheses last updated march 29 2016 file size 20 megabytes you want to um Click on the download Showbox APK in the box right there. If you want to download a later version of Showbox, just scroll down. You'll see version 4.53 APK um, down below that. Mm, um, I already have it downloaded, so I'm just going to go to the app. But once you're done downloading download it, just click on the app in the notification bar and install the app. Now, once the app is installed, what you want to do is find Showbox, go in it. You'll be brought up to this app right here. Um, version um, four point six one comes out comes with news of which which movies are going to be coming out in the later future. Um, they also have updates of movies. Um, for example, here's one of the movies. Nina, um, you could um download the movie from server. Sorry, um. So this is one thing I've got to say. When you're uh, on Showbox, ads will come up. We um due due to this little black bar with the spinning circle in it because of the stuff is all loading. But um, you could download the movie you want to download from server one. Server eight, or you could do um um download it as a torrent. I suggest downloading it from server one. If you download it from server eight or server four, if there is a server four, then you'll be downloading parts of the movie. So say the movie is about two hours long, um, you'll be downloading about eighteen parts of the movie, and that will be over a hundred megabytes large. So I suggest downloading it from server one. Um, if your phone, sorry about that notification, but if you're downloading it, um, as a torrent, um, you want to make sure you have a really good phone with, uh, good graphics because the video will tend to flake out, flake in and out. Um, and I also just suggest you download a, um, a video player from, uh, Google Play, the, from the Google Play Store. Um, the best... Um, video player on the Google Play Store is MX Movie Player. I've been using that for about three years now, and it's I've had no problems whatsoever. Um, so you also have um shows, um in here, um the Brinks, the Leftovers, the Musketeers, Blue Exorcist, Game of Thrones, NCIS, Naval Crisis, or whatever. Um and so much more. Uh, you also have uh my section, which is your TV shows. Um, as you can see, I have a whole bunch of my TV shows that I download and watch. I don't like um uh, watching it over Wi-Fi because it tends to buffer a lot. Um, you you also, you have the download section, which shows you what you've downloaded. Um, you have your favorites, which shows you um all the TV shows that you've saved to so you can download. You have your movies, which, um, same thing, which you save so you can download later. 
you have the trailers of certain movies that have come out or that are coming out. Um, you have your TV show, TV show section. And you have your movie section. You also have the music section where you can download a whole bunch of movies. I mean, download a whole bunch of music. Um, like work, stressed out, cheap thrills, stitches, chandelier, are you mine, feel good, incorporated, and hotline, hotline, um, bling, and many more. Under that, you could search music. You could also go to your music that you've downloaded from Showbox, and you could go to your my playing section, which plays the music that you've downloaded from Showbox. And one thing about Showbox is that if you go in your file manager and you have an external SD card, what you want to do is go on your internal SD card, find the um, movie or TV show you downloaded, um, touch and hold it and go to more and move that movie or TV show to your SD card, create a folder named Showbox just like this, just like this one. And um, just uh, put the movie or TV show in that. That way, when you want to download another um, movie or TV show, you have enough um, storage on your internal storage uh, when you're downloading things. Um, this is only for Samsung. Like, this method I'm showing you here for, like, if you're downloading stuff. Because when you're downloading stuff on uh, Samsung's phone from show Showbox, it will go right to the internal storage. Same thing for LG, it will go right to the internal storage. But if you have a phone like um, um, Alcatel, one, if you have a phone like the Alcatel One Touch Fierce 2, then it will download to the SD card if you have an um, external SD card. Um, uh, here is one of my TV shows that I've downloaded, Limitless Season 1, Episode 20. Um... Uh, uh, and there's many more movies and TV shows that are going to be coming out in the future on Showbox. I am basically hoping that more seasons or episodes for The Secret Circle is coming out too. And some other TV shows. And that's it, basically. That's it for today, guys. Please like and subscribe. I'm out. Peace.